All right, medical students, let's jump into an essential molecule for cardiovascular health nitric oxide or NO for short. This little molecule produced mainly in the endothelial cells of our blood vessels is a powerhouse when it comes to keeping our heart and blood vessels in check. First up, nitric oxide is a vasodilator. That means it helps relax the blood vessels. How? No acts on the smooth muscle cells in our blood vessels, causing them to expand. This expansion leads to smoother blood flow and reduced blood pressure. This is crucial for those battling hypertension. When no levels are up, vascular resistance goes down, helping alleviate high blood pressure. But that's not all. No also plays a star role in preventing arteriosclerosis. Arteriosclerosis kicks off when our vascular endothelial cells get damaged and this is where inflammation and oxidative stress come into play. No swoops in with its anti-inflammatory properties protecting those endothelial cells and keeping our blood vessels healthy. It even helps prevent blood clots which can slow down the progression of arteriosclerosis. And let's not forget about its role in medication. Various cardiovascular drugs harness the power of NO. Take nitrate drugs for instance, they convert into nitric oxide in the body, dilating blood vessels. These meds are lifesavers for conditions like angina pectoris and heart failure, easing the strain on the cardiovascular system. In conclusion, nitric oxide is central to maintaining cardiovascular health and treating diseases like hypertension and arteriosclerosis. Enhancing no production and function could be a game changer in the prevention and treatment of cardiovascular diseases. And there you have it, the mighty nitric oxide in a nutshell. Keep this info handy, it's bound to pop up in your studies and practice. Thanks for tuning in, and stay curious.